we will do in that we were having different uh, lenses and then concave convexes even the biconvex equiconvex plano convex plano concave these and all are the different uh, lenses we were having even the concave or convex also there so based on that we'll have mainly in this are <laughs> focus f1 is nothing but which point that is object to point object point for which image will be formed at what distance infinity distance whenever you consider the f2 f2 is nothing but image point that if for that image point where the object will be placed object will be placed at infinity and after that we have discussed about the lens formula and also lens makers formula what is the lens formula 1 by b minus 1 by u is equals to 1 by f that is what the lens formula we have discussed after that lens makers formula what is that f is equals to f is equals to what is the formula mu relative minus 1 into 1 by r1 minus 1 by r2 what is that mu relative mu lens divided by mu medium so mu lens divided by mu m otherwise mu lens with respect to the medium we will discuss that is what the uh, lens makers formula we had in that obviously we will keep always the lens in the air medium then only we got mu g minus 1 directly otherwise mu l minus 1 directly if we keep in water at that time you have to take it as a mu g by mu w only what is the mu w 4 by 3 mu g 1.5 or 3 by 2 mu of the air is 1 so that is what lens makers and then lens formula we have discussed after that we have discussed the image formation rules so for that for convex mirror we had uh, six rules for the concave uh, not mirror i'm sorry lens for the concave lens we are having two rules convex lens is also known as which lens converging lens concave lens is known as diverging lens so for the converging lens first rule was whenever the object is placed at infinity at that time where the image is formed focus you just remember that as a focus if I am talking about the image nothing but at that time it will be obviously f2 if I am talking about the object means that will be f1 so whenever the object is taken at the infinity then image will be formed exactly at f2 and also that image will be which type of image real inverted and highly diminished why because for the extended object you will get only point sized image that is about the first rule we had then after that whenever the object is placed beyond c1 or beyond 2 f1 then where the image will be formed between c and f right generally c and f nothing but which c and f other side that is f2 and 2 f2 now the image will be which type of image real image inverted image and diminished image and also now the object is placed on the c1 nothing but 2 f1 then where the image will be formed 2 f2 why because on the c only again for the case of mirrors we were getting in the same side for this lenses we are getting in the opposite side now the image will be formed at 2 f2 so the image will be inverted image real and size same size now whenever the object is placed between c1 and f1 nothing but 2 f1 and then f1 where the image will be formed beyond c2 that is what the just opposite to second case i think so so whenever the object is placed beyond c image will be formed between c and f now object is only placed between c and f then image will be formed beyond c now object is placed between c1 and f1 means image will be formed beyond c2 or obviously otherwise 2 f2 now what i can say whenever we are coming near to the lens image size will get enlarged real inverted and enlarged image then after that whenever i place the object exactly on the f1 focus one then where the image will be formed infinity, infinity. that infinity image will be it will be inverted and real and highly enlarged it will be then after that last case we have discussed that whenever the object is kept between f1 and p optical center then where the image will be formed image will be formed in the same side otherwise opposite side same side and also that will be erected virtual and enlarged those were the different cases in the convex lens otherwise converging lens 
Next one is diverging lens or concave lens. For that, we are having only two cases. One of the cases is whenever the object is kept at infinity, where the image will be formed. Which focus that is? F2 only obviously. That is F2 and also that image will be which type of image? Virtual image and erected and what I said that is highly diminished. Then after that we are having that wherever it might be on the principal axis. So where the image will be formed? Image will be formed between F2 and P. Generally in the uh, concave, the, the convex mirror also the same thing only. Whenever, wherever you might be placed the object, it will be formed between F and P only. Here also the same thing but F2 and P. Why? Because image we are discussing about. Now, that image will be, what type of image? Erected, virtual and size diminished. The size will be diminished. Okay. These and all are the different uh, image diagrams and all we have discussed. And after that, what we have discussed? Lens formula, lens makers formula finished. Then finding the focal lens, no? Yeah, finding the focal length of equi convex lens we got. How much focal length we got? F is equals to R by mu minus 1. Plano convex? No, equi convex is R by 2 mu minus 1. Plano convex R by mu minus 1. So only we have discussed that F dash is equals to 2 times of F we have discussed. And after that, plano concave minus r by mu minus 1 i said already for the concave lens the focal length will be negative for the convex lens that will be positive these are not the different problems we have discussed so far and after that we have cut the lens into two parts one is perpendicular to principal axis then what happened perpendicular to principal axis nothing but focal length is doubled f f dash is equals to two times of f for one of the lens, another lens also same only. Whenever we are cutting exactly along the principal axis, then what happened? Focal length is same only. There is no change in that. Clear? And also, but what happened? Intensity was decreasing. Why? Because we will get only by one single ray only. Before we were having two rays, now we will get only one ray. That is what we have discussed, I think so. Have you done the problems first? Everybody did that, otherwise I have given to you that work. Focal lens, you have to find out the focal lens that and all. Is the curved surface about the discuss more than you? I mean, lenses start with you. Madhra, all right. Have you solved this one? Problems, R by mu minus 1, R by 2 mu minus 1 and all. Everybody understood that? I think I have done a little fast on that day. Did you understand? Yes. So, next one is... Next one is power, power of the lens, power of the lens, power of the mirror is what, P is equals to minus 1 by F, minus is very important there, minus 1 by F in meters, in centimeters, 100 by F, do you remember that formula, yes, in the same way here also, what will get P is equals to just 1 by F will get, not minus, just 1 by F in meters and P is equals to 100 by F in centimeters and also what is the unit of power I said in the mirrors also diopter the power will be measured in terms of diopter diopter that's a power now write a problem find the number of images Find the number of images formed by the given lens which is made up of different refractive indices as shown in the figure as shown in the figure. Oh, you are ready to go. I am not going to go. See that this is a diagram. How many number of images will be formed? Can you tell me that? Five. 
Any other answer? How you got five? How many mediums are there here? Three mediums. Three mediums. One is glass medium. This mu one and then here mu three. Three mediums are there. And also below also the same mediums only I have taken. Uniformly I made it. Then how many number of images are possible? For one object, how many number of images are possible? First of all, tell me images will be one, otherwise more than one. More than one. So, how many are possible means, let us see the diagram. Here I kept the object. Let me take a point object is there here. Obviously, we will take the number of rays. How many number of incidence rays you want, you can take it. So, first of all, I will take one of the incident ray on to the medium, medium mu1. Then next one is on to the medium mu2. Then next is on to the medium mu3. In the same manner, symmetrically I will take in the below direction also like this. Now, you have to find out the image. Image nothing but what? The intersecting point of refractor rays only. That is what the image. So, that how to get the image means, image will get like this. Now, tell me how many number of images are possible. Three images. So, that is purely depends on there is no formula, nothing will be there. Just you have to mainly identify that how many number of refractive indices are there, that many number of images will be formed. So, here due to mu3 and then mu3 is symmetrically here, here one image will be formed. Here let me take this is i3, i2 and i1. From the refractive index mu1, i1 will be formed. Next from mu2, i2 will be formed. From mu3, i3 will be formed. You just write that number of images formed by number of images formed by a lens which is made up of lens which is made up of different refractive indices different refractive indices will be depends on number of number of number of mediums considered Right, the three images will be formed I1, I2, I3. Where is Pratika and Bhavana? From morning onwards. See that next Cauchy's formula. Cauchy's formula. Correct, eh, na? C A U C H Y. Correct, eh, na? Correct, illa andre gorada barkori correct formula na correct spelling hai bari reste. Yeh spelling spelling se aaron orala neat exam ali. Don't worry about that. And I got a news in the morning that this year also might be fifty questions only. This year also might be like last year only question paper pattern. It is not by NTA, but it was uh, just news. So, choice will be there, internal choice will be there like last year only section A and then section B. Like that, uh, uh, this one, rumors are coming. I don't know that is true or false. And also by the April first week itself, notification will be released. And also, they are saying that almost like June ending or July first week, compulsory exam will be there. And uh, Shreyas already know that why because he will use the phone often, very oftenly. And he might be said uh, all the secrets to promote also, they already know that. Yatish, you don't know? Yake dispatch agi the ribbu? Divorce agi the va? Illa, government of Karnataka prakara obrey irbe ka, you know. Right now, Kashi's formula. Okay, you miss agi the 
ಸಿ ಮಿಸ್ ಆಗಿದಾ ಯಾವುದೋ ಒಂದು ಹಾಂ ಕಾಶಿ ವಾರಣಾಸಿ ಕಾಶಿ ಫಾಮ್ಲಾ ಸೊ ಮ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಬಿ ಬೈ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಸಿ ಬೈ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಸ್ಕ್ವೇರ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಡಿ ಬೈ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಕ್ಯೂಬ್ ಆನ್ ಸೋನ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಐ ನೀ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಫಾರ್ ಎ ಸೇರ್ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಪವರ್ ಜೀರೋ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಪವರ್ ಜೀರೋ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಪವರ್ ಒನ್ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಪವರ್ ಟು ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಪವರ್ ತ್ರೀ ಆನ್ ಸೋನ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಸೊ ಹಿಯರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ಲಿ ಸೇ ದಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಆರ್ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಬೈ ದ ವೇ ಸೊ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಐ ಸೇ ದಟ್ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ಯು ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ದ ಬೈನಾಮಿಲ್ ಇಕ್ವೇಷನ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ವಿಲ್ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಹೋಲ್ ಪವರ್ ಎನ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಕ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ವರ್ಲಿ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಎನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ರೈಟ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಒನ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಎನ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮಚ್ ಆಫ್ ಬಿಗರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲಾ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ದೇರ್ ಬಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ದಟ್ ವೈ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ದ ಎಕ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಅಟ್ ದಟ್ ಟೈಮ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಅಪ್ಲೈ ದ ಬೈನಾಮಿಲ್ ಇಕ್ವೇಷನ್ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ಡ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ವೇ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ಯು ಅಬ್ಸರ್ವ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೂ ಟರ್ಮ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದೆನ್ ಕೆನ್ ಐ ಸೇ ದಟ್ ಮ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಮ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ವೈ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಐ ಸೆಡ್ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ಲಿ ದಟ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಸಿ ಡಿ ಆರ್ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ಕಾನ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಮ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ನೌ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಮ್ಯೂ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ಟೆಲ್ ಮಿ ಮ್ಯೂ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ವೆನ್ ಎವರ್ ಯು ಸಿ ದ ಈಕ್ವಿ ಕಾನ್ವೆಕ್ಸ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಯು ಟೆಲ್ ಮಿ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಈಕ್ವಿ ಕಾನ್ವೆಕ್ಸ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆನ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲಾ ಆರ್ ಬೈ ಟೂ ಇಂಟು ಮ್ಯೂ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಸೊ ಕೆನ್ ಐ ರೈಟ್ ದಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯೂ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಎಸ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯೂ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ವೈ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಮೈ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲಾ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ಆರ್ ಬೈ ಮ್ಯೂ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಆರ್ ಆರ್ ಬೈ ಟೂ ಮ್ಯೂ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ನಾವು ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ವರ್ಸ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯೂ ಮೈನಸ್ ಒನ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ನಾವು ಹಿಯರ್ ಒನ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ಕಾನ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಒನ್ ಈಸ್ ಕಾನ್ಸ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ದೆನ್ ಕೆನ್ ಐ ಸೇ ದಟ್ ಒನ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯೂ ನಾವು ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೂ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ರೈಟ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯೂ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಕೆನ್ ಐ ಸೇ ದಟ್ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ಎಫ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರಪೋರ್ಷನಲ್ ಟು ಲ್ಯಾಮ್ಡಾ ವೈ ವಿ ಗಾಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ರಿಲೇಷನ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಫೈಂಡ್ ಔಟ್ ದ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ಫಾರ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಲೈಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ವೇವ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ವೈ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಲೈಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಆಬ್ವಿಯಸ್ಲಿ ವಿ ನೋ ವಿ ನೋ ದಟ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ವಿಸಿಬಲ್ ಲೈಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ವೇವ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಫಾರ್ ಈಚ್ ವೇವ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ವಿಚ್ ವೇವ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ಅ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ವಿಚ್ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಬಟ್ ಆ್ಯಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಅವರ್ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಮಿರರ್ ವಾಸ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಡಿಪೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ದ ರೇಡಿಯಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಕರ್ವೇಚರ್ ವಾಟ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲಾ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಎಫ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ಆರ್ ಬೈ ಟು ನೋ ಮ್ಯಾಟರ್ ವೇರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಕೀಪಿಂಗ್ ದ ಮಿರರ್ ನೋ ಮ್ಯಾಟರ್ ವಿಚ್ ಟೈಪ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಿರರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಎಫ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ಆರ್ ಬೈ ಟು ನೋ ಹಿಯರ್ ಫೋಕಲ್ ಲೆಂತ್ ವಿಲ್ ಪ್ಯೂರ್ಲಿ ಡಿಪೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ದ ರಿಫ್ರಾಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಇಂಡೆಕ್ಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಈವನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಮೇಕರ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ
can i say that mu red is less than mu violet this formula will be useful in the prism also you have to remember that mu of the red less than mu of the violet nothing but red will bend less as compared to the violet clear that is about even based on the deviation also will be there delta of the red will be some relation with the delta of violet and all clear that is about the cauchy's formula write that copy everything here a b c are positive constants सिक्सटी नो इट्टी दाने वो बर्ताय लेते हैं सुमें नंबर नोडे के कॉपी एवरीथिंग लेट्स प्ले हाइड एंड सीक नो इफ आई से हाइड एंड सीक सम वीपर विल से दैट लेट्स सीट हाइड एंड सीक Nene, somebody gone to Tripular movie? Dev Raja, Asif. No, did the movie? No, did I? Did that look no, did I? You don't know, eh? How to how to deal in the situations also. You just have to come and then you have to ask me. Madam, six hundred beko. Tumbar urgent idhe ne. Movie not beko na ho. Movie kog beko kudre andre. नमके भाई आगे तो कल से क्या है ना आगे तो है मैं तो तीन बर्ती मरा वंदरे कल से ना ला मेरी पूर पूर पीपल इला ये वो तो फंक्शनल ओपन इला मैडम ये न फंक्शन सिला नमके डेली फंक्शनल ओटा मारी ला अंदर नमके एंगो ये रहते हैं वन सिक्स हंड्रेड कोर्टर मरा वंदरे कोर्टी ना ला मूवी को अगर को त्रिपुल ये वो तो एक बंदी ला, देवराज जी वो तित्तु उन दो, फंक्शनो, पुष्पा सम, पुष्पा वेर्स समथिंग समथिंग वाज देर नेम, पुष्पा वेर्स श्री वाली वाज देर, हैं गाउतम, काशी स्वाम ला फिनिश नो, यस आफ्टर दैट Lens taken from air medium to the liquid medium. Then how the focal length will change us and all we will discuss. In this, mainly listen in this, whenever I have taken the air, lens in the air, at, the, at that time focal length will be Fa. Nothing but focal length of the lens in the air medium is Fa. Then whenever you see the focal length formula, what is the uh, lens maker's formula? 1 by F is equals to mu relative minus 1 into 1 by R1 minus 1 by R2. What is that mu relative? Mu lens by mu medium. Lens will be made up of which medium? Glass. So that mu G by mu air. Second case, I will take the same lens into the liquid medium. Not water, liquid medium I will take. Then what I can say? Mu G by mu L. Liquid is mu L. Okay, don't confuse in the nomenclatures. Here mu L is not lens, mu L is the liquid, small l I will take. Lens, uh, lens refractive index is how much I said? Mu G. So whenever first of all I have taken in the air, then focal length I am getting as F A. Whenever I have taken the same lens into the water or liquid, at that time I am getting the refract, uh, this one focal length as F L. And now I want to find out the F L will be how many times of F A. That is what the relation between F L and F A I want to find. In that, mainly the relation will be based on three, three cases here. One is, whenever the liquid refractive index is 
less than the glass refractive index nothing but in whichever the liquid we are dipping the lens that liquid is having less refractive index as compared to the glass for a perfect example is water and then lens we can take up water refractive index is how much 4 by 3 nothing but 1.33 wow, glass refractive index is 1.5 in this case what happens nothing but the lens will work like as which lens nothing but in this uh, the cases will be reversed also so lens nature is water in that case next case is whenever the refractive index of the glass is exactly equal to the refractive index of lens the liquid then what happens generally what happens whenever the glass refractive index is same as the liquid refractive index then what happens refraction happens or does not happen tell me when the refraction will happen whenever the light is entering from one medium to another medium of different refractive indices now i'm saying that both are having same refractive index so that refraction never happens the light will travel just like normal only then in that case again lens is not visible in the water you cannot see the lens why because both are having same refractive index there same density is there so that both are same nature so that you cannot see the glass in the water are able to assume that how it will happen so why both are having same refractive index so only the lens is not visible in the glass you cannot separate that and nothing but you cannot identify where is the glass and also next case is whenever the refractive index of liquid is greater than the glass at that time case will be reversed then what happens the convex uh, lens will work as diverging lens actually convex lens is which lens converging lens it will become as diverging concave lens become as converging lens why it will happen nothing but we will get the negative focal length there focal length will be reversed so whenever we calculate that you can understand easily but you just get idea about three cases one is mu of the liquid is less than the mu of the glass normal as it is procedure converging and then diverging mu of the liquid is equals to mu of the glass then glass is not visible no refraction takes place and also at that time focal length will be infinity i'll prove that how it will be then third case is whenever the liquid refractive index is more than the glass refractive index then convex lens becomes as a diverging lens then concave lens becomes as a converging lens why because we'll get the focal length in negative clear that we'll derive now so now first of all i have taken a lens of refractive index how much i said mu g is taken in the air medium mu a then what is the focal length 1 by f a is equals to in the air 1 by f a is equals to what i can write here mu g by mu a minus 1 into 1 by r1 minus 1 by r2 is that correct yes so here mu of the lens by mu of the medium you have to consider that is what i have considered then after that i am taking the same lens of mu g only in a liquid in a liquid i have considered of refractive index mu l then tell me 1 by fl is equals to what will get 1 by fl is equals to mu g by mu l minus 1 into 1 by r1 minus 1 by r2 then i want to get the uh, refra uh, this one focal length in the liquid so that what i can write uh, if i e divide both the equation 1 and 2 1 by 2 if i do then what will get here fl by fa is equals to 1 by r1 minus 1 by r2 gets cancelled however then what will be remaining here mu g by mu a minus 1 that divided by mu g by mu l minus 1 what is this mu a value 1 air value is 1 so what you can write easily here mu g minus 1 by mu g by mu l minus 1 this is the final formula we got in this now we'll get the three different cases i said one ca first case is what mu l is less than mu g another case is mu l is is equals to mu g then again mu l is greater than mu g then what happens we'll see and first and foremost case is mu g is less than mu l is less than mu g first case mu l less than mu g perfect example is what i can take water and then glass let's substitute the values approximately and then we'll get the answer f l by f a is equals to mu g what is the mu g value 1.5 minus 1 by and then mu g value is 1.5 by mu of the water is how much 1.33 minus 
This is what the final value whenever you substitute you will get. Then 1.5 minus 1 is what I can write 0 0.5. This will be how many times? 1 point. How many times it will be? 2 will be remaining. Na? 0 0 0.06 approximately. 1.06. Why? Because your 20 will be there obviously that will be 6 times. So that 1.06 minus 1. How much you will get? 0 0.06. 0 0.06 this is FL by FA now I want to get the FL only approximately I will just uh, ignore this one can I write this as 0 0.5 into FA in front of 0 0.5 I am just neglecting the 0 0.06 however it is not negligible but for the approximation calculation I am doing this so FL is equal to what I can write 0 0.5 times of FA now which is bigger tell, tell me that FL is bigger than FA right so that FL is greater than FA nothing but whenever you are just taking the lens from the air to the liquid then what happening here focal length is increasing increasing by approximately this many times whenever you are taking into the water okay now focal length is increasing then what happens to the power decreases. power will decreases why because p is equal to what is the formula 1 by f reciprocal so that focal length will increases whenever you are going from the aid to the liquid and also the condition should be what here mu l greater than mu l is less than mu g power will decreases okay power will decreases now nature of the convex and then concave lenses is same or different same is there any negative symbols here nothing is there so that convex lens will work like a converging lens only and concave lens will work like a diverging lens only anything wrong hmm? fa is greater fl is equal to some times of fa no i have written hmm? 1 by 2 na no actually FA, fl has to increase this value exactly how much can you calculate that how many times it will be 0 0.1 uh, exactly actually it has to increase only approximation values we have taken let's see 1.12 this one is 1.12 27 pm 0 0.12 na 4.16 that is the exact answer okay now what happening here fl is increasing whenever you are just taking the lens from the air to the water at that time what happens focal length will increases as the focal length increases then what happens power will decreases as the power decreases then after that what happens means the nature will be same nature only again whenever you come to the next case that next case is second case what i said mu l is exactly equals to mu g then fl by fa formula is what is that mu g by mu g minus 1 mu g minus 1 by mu g by mu l nothing but in the place of mu l what i can write mu g only so that mu g minus 1 mu g mu g gets cancelled here what will be remaining here 1 minus 1 so what it will be infinity so that f l by f a is equals to infinity then f l is equals to infinity times of f a nothing but again what is that infinity only now whenever you are taking the lens uh, lens uh, into the liquid which is having same refractive index as compared to the glass at that time focal length will become what infinity here what is that focal length infinity means what is the meaning of that is that curved surface otherwise plane surface plane surface it will act like a plane glass only nothing but it will not do anything it will not do any refraction it will just pass as the light so that it will become like this nothing will happen like that only light will transfer when it will bends when the light will bends whenever the refractive index is different either denser to rarer or rarer to denser pavitra good morning nidde control madek aagta illa ellello nodta idru avuda illa something you are thinking so here 
whenever the refractive index of the two mediums are same then light does not bends whenever the light is traveling the air means that will be straight only whenever it is traveling the water means it will be straight only there is no change in the direction so here also nothing will happen so here concave lens will be there like this only there is no bending process and also you cannot even identify the lens also where the lens is there so whenever it is just passing the light like that nothing but it is just acting like fl is equal to infinity nothing but it is just like acting like plain glass only plain glass lab only so that is about the uh, second case that is mu l is equal to mu g the next case is whenever the mu l is greater than mu g mu l greater than mu g then what happens what happens in the denominator see that f l by f a is equals to mu g minus 1 by mu g by mu l minus 1 i said that mu l is greater than mu 1 mu uh, mu g then what happens this will become as what negative negative into some value will become so that what i can say f l is equals to negative times of f a correct why because this is becoming as negative here for example this will be 0 0.5 and then this will be 1 then what happens 0 0.5 minus 1 nothing but minus 0 0.5 will be there so at minus 0 0.5 nothing but minus f a we will get here so f l is equal to minus times of uh, f a nothing but the nature will be in reverse nature will be in reverse that is now this convex lens will work like a diverging lens like this in reality this is wrong but whenever we are taking the lens into a medium that medium refractive index is more than the lens refractive index at that time the operation will be reversed that is convex lens will become as a diverging lens and then concave lens will become as a converging lens this will never happen in our normal ray diagrams so whenever we are dipping the lens in a medium in a such a way that that medium is having more refractive index as compared to the lens then the operation will be reversed the nature will be reversed here clear huh? copy everything you understood everything right whenever it is less equal and greater ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಪೋ <laughs> 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 ಮಾಡಿದ್ರಾ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಮಾಡಿಲ್ಲ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಕೂಡ ಅಥು ವೇಸ್ಟ್ ಜಾಲಿ ಕರುಣ ದಯಾ ಈ ಥರ ಏನೂ ಇಲ್ಲ ಜಾಲಿ ಅಂದರೆ ಏನು ನೆಟ್ಟಾ ಕನ್ನಡದಲ್ಲಿ ಕರುಣ ಕರುಣೆ ಹಾಂ ತರುಣ ಜಾಲಿ ಅಂದರೆ ಕನ್ಸರ್ನ್ ಹಾಂ ಹಾಂ ಮುಳ್ಳುನ ಮುಳ್ಳು ಅಂದರೆ ಇನ್ ತೆಲುಗು ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹಾಂ ದೆನ್ ಜಾಲಿ ಅಂದರೆ ಮುಳ್ಳು ಅನೇ ಅರ್ಥನ ಹರ್ಷಕ್ಕೆ ತಟ್ಕೊಳಕ್ಕೆ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇಲ್ಲಲ್ಲ ಈ ಎಲ್ಲ ಕನ್ನಡ ತೆಲುಗು ಕ್ಲಾಸಸ್ ನೋಡಿ ಏನ್ ಮಾಡ್ಬೇಕು ಸ್ಮಾರ್ಟಿ ಮನೆಗೆ ಹೋಗಿ ಇನ್ನು ಸ್ಮಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಗ್ಬೇಕಾ 
ಫ್ಯಾನ್ಸ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ವೆಯ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇರ್ತಾರೆ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಾಗ್ರಾಮಲ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಾಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಪ್ರೊಫೈಲ್ ನೇಮ ಸ್ಮಾರ್ಟಿ ಕಿರಣ್ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟಾಗ್ರಾಮ್ದ ನೀವೇ ಹಂಗಿಟ್ಟಿದ್ರ ತುಂಬ ಸ್ಮಾರ್ಟ್ ಇದ್ದಾರೆ ನೀ ಇವರೆಲ್ಲ ಹೋಗಿದ್ರು ನಂಬರ್ ಒನ್ ಗೈ ಕಾಲ್ ಫ್ರ್ಯಾಕ್ಚರ್ ಅಂದ ಏನಂದು ಎಕ್ಕಡ ಎಕ್ಕಡ ನಿನ್ನ ಸಾಯಂತ್ರಮ್ಮ ಹಾಸ್ಟೆಲ್ ಅಣ್ಣ ಎಕ್ಕಡ ಬಾತ್ರೂಮ್ ಬಡ್ಡಾಡ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಆಯ್ತಾ ಇವರಾಜ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪನೇ ಅವ್ರು ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಇರ್ತಾರೆ ರೆಸ್ಟ್ ತಗೊಂಡಿ ಹೌದಾ ಅಷ್ಟು ಸ್ಪೇಸ್ ಕೂಡ ಇಲ್ಲ ಅದೇ ನೀವು ಆ ಥರ ಬಿದ್ದಿರ್ತಾರೆ ನಾವೇ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಚಿಕ್ಕವಾಗಿ ಕಟ್ಟರಪ್ಪ ಅನೇ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಹೇಳಿದ್ವಿ ಅವ್ರು ಬರ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ರಿಪೇರ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಡೈಲಿ ಬರ್ತಾ ಇರ್ತಾರೆ ಕಾಲೇಜ್ಗೆ ರೂಮ್ಸ್ ರೂಮ್ಸ್ ದೊಡ್ಡ ಇರ್ತೇನ ರೂಮ್ಸ್ ಕೂಡ ಚಿಕ್ಕವೇನ ಹೌದಾ ಅಂದರೆ ಕಾಟ್ ಹಾಕ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ರೆ ಅಂದರೆ ನಡಿಯೋಕ್ಕೆ ಈ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ಇರಲ್ಲ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಎಲ್ಲರೂ ಹೊರಗಡೆ ಇರ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಬಾಲ್ಕನಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ನು ಬಂದಿದ್ದೀನಿ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಹಾಸ್ಲಿಗೆ ನಾನು ಒಳಗೆ ಕೂಡ ಬಂದೀನಿ ನಿಮ್ಮ ರೂಮ್ಗೆ ಬಂದಿದ್ದೀನಿ ನಿಮ್ಗೆ ನೋಡೋಕ್ಕಾಗಲ್ಲ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಹೊರಗಡೆ ಬಂದು ಬಂದ ಏನು ಎತ್ತಿಸೋಣ ಏನು ಫೇಸ್ ಆರ್ ಯು ಫೀಲಿಂಗ್ ಬ್ಯಾಡ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಓಕೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನಾನು ಇವತ್ತು ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಮಾತಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ರು ನಾಳೆ ಪ್ರಮೋದ್ ಮನೆಗೆ ಹೋಗ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ಇವತ್ತು ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಮಾತಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ರು ನಿಮಗೆ ಟೈಮ್ ಬೇಕಂದರೆ ಕೊಡ್ತೀನಪ್ಪ ಹೋಗ್ರಿ ಹೊರಗಡೆ ಹೋಗಿ ಮಾತಾಡ್ಕೋರಿ ಸುಮ್ಮನೆ ನಮಗೆ ಹಾಗೆ ಡಿಸ್ಟರ್ಬ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಇಬ್ಬರು ನಾವೇ ನಿಮಗೆ ಡಿಸ್ಟರ್ಬ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ವಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದ್ ಹೋಗಿದ್ರೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಏನು ಯತೀಶಿರ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಇನ್ನು ಕಾನ್ವೆಕ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಾನ್ಕೇವ್ ಲೆನ್ಸಸ್ ಇನ್ನು ಮಿರರ್ ಫಾ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಯು ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ ನೋ ರೈಟ್ ಓಪನ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ರೈಟ್ ದ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ ಇಕಾಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲ ಜನರಲಿ ಹಾಂ ಹಾಂ ಎಸ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ವಿ ಬೈ ಯು ಇನ್ ದ ಕೇಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಿರರ್ ಬಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಯು ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ದಟ್ ನೋ ರೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನಿಟ್ಯೂಡ್ ವಿ ರೈಟ್ ಎಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಟು ಮಾಡ್ಲಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವಿ ಬೈ ಯು so v by u na the but already we have discussed this formulas 1 by v minus 1 by u is equals to how much 1 by f from this f is equals to how much only f is equals to u v by u minus v and u is equals to how much f v by f minus v na ah uh, f minus v v minus f ah hey, eh f minus v re v is equals to what we have discussed f u by f plus u correct everything so these are the different formulas we have discussed here in the uh, lens formula anything wrong here f minus v only na correct only so these are the different formulas we have discussed in the lens formulas in that uh, lens formula only you write the magnification magnification is modulus of v by u in that m is equals to v by u nothing but v is equals to what is the formula f u by f plus u that divided by u u u gets cancel m is equals to f by f plus u that's the magnification one of the formula in terms of focal length and then object distance then after that in terms of f and v you have to get uh, what is the formula v by in the place of u what i can write f v by f minus v so f v by f minus v 
then V V gets cancelled. Then what will be remaining here? F minus V by F. These are the different formulas of magnification. In terms of U and V, I want to get means what will get? Just V by U only. M is equal to V by U. R M is equal to F by F plus U. R M is equal to F minus V by F. That is about the magnification. Make it fast. We will finish the lenses today. Tomorrow we will discuss the problems at least based on this. These are not already there. These formulas are there already. Just copy these formulas only. Let me show you water bottle. Take a moment. इधर ना नहीं उकड़ दे रहा यार वो एसके पागी दरो ना ना वो कल अपा निम कोस्टन इल्ले इरते ने नाम लाइफ लांग त्यागा मारते ने नाम जीविता के त्यागा मारते ने निम कोस्टन जीवन है ना जीविता अंदर गर्ल्स ने अपनो ऐ जीविता के नाने इन त्याग मारा ला जीवन आके त्याग मारते नहीं जीविता अंदर ये लिटरे करकम बरी मत्ते अंदर ने एक बारा ला राइट नेक्स्ट कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ लेंसेस कटिंग ऑफ लेंस हाँ ये ना क्या लगता है इधर कटिंग ऑफ लेंस कटिंग ऑफ लेंस so here in this cutting of lens already we have discussed in that we will discuss the power. So whenever we are just cutting the lens perpendicular to the principal axis then what happens? Now everything is about the combinations, cuttings and also arrangement. So all will be all will look like same only but uh, they will have different formulas you have to observe properly. Then here I have taken that we are just cutting the lens perpendicular to principal axis. Then what happening it is becoming as two parts like this and already we have discussed the focal lens also f dash is equal to how much here f only e n two times of f m yes f dash is equal to two times of f f by two na two times of f yes and also here i'll just tell you one short trick that whenever the width is uh, same then focal length also same if width is decreasing then focal length will increases if width is increasing then focal length will decreases okay now whenever you come here this is the width the total width is how much i can say that is d focal length is how much here f now what happening separately this one what is happening it is becoming as d by 2 this is also becoming as how much here d by 2 whenever the width is decreasing then what i said focal length will increases so only here width is decreasing and then focal length is increases here so then here whenever it is becoming as 2f means tell me power dash p dash is equal to how much P by 2. Generally, P is equal to what is the formula? 1 by F. P dash is equal to 1 by F dash. 1 by F dash nothing but how much it will be? 1 by 2F. This 1 by F is nothing but how much again? P only. So, what I can write clearly? P by 2. Right. This power also, this P dash also how much equals to P by 2 only. This is the first case whenever we are cutting perpendicular to the principal axis. Whenever we are cutting along the principal axis. Then what happens along the principal axis like this? Then what happens? The lenses will become like this. Two parts will be there like this. Then tell me the width is changing or not changing? Not changing, right? So that this is D means this is also much D only. This is also D only. Then what happens here? Focal length is F means here also focal length is how much F? And then this is also F only. This is power P means this P dash is equal to how much P only. P dash also equals to how much? P only. That is about whenever you are cutting the lens perpendicular to the principal axis and then along the principal axis. Next one is arrangement of the lenses will be there. 
that is whenever we are arranging the lens in this manner lenses of different focal lengths f1 f2 f3 then what i can write net focal length is equal to how much 1 by f is equals to 1 by f1 plus 1 by f2 plus 1 by f3 1 by f is equal to nothing but this entire thing will work like a lens only again that lens focal length will be 1 by f is equals to 1 by f1 plus 1 by f2 plus 1 by f3 now tell me what is the power will be p is equals to what i can write p1 plus p2 plus p3 that's it now magnification whenever you come to the magnification the magnification will become you have to just multiply them m1 into m2 into m3 the same thing i said about the refractive indexes also for the different mediums whenever we have taken the refraction slabs at that time i said the same thing only but their refractive index mu2 1 mu3 2 mu3 1 is equal to how much 1 yes do you remember that note point i said in the same way here also magnifications will be multiplied and also that uh, mu21 mu32 was at and all i have used no is equals to 1 in the same way here also we will take the product of magnifications is equals to 1 in one of the problem we will take that i will explain you that clear so this is about the arrangement of lens whenever we are just placing one after other at that time focal length will become this much and then power will be this much and then magnification is this now whenever the lenses are placed at a distance d apart then what will be the focal length any idea about that focal length 1 by f is equals to the focal length will get decreased why because the distance is increasing between between them so at that time focal length will be 1 by f1 plus 1 by f2 minus d by f1 into f2 that is the formula you have to remember mainly 1 by f1 plus 1 by f2 minus distance between them divided by the product of the focal lengths now tell me in terms of power p is equals to what i can write p1 plus p2 plus minus d into p1 into p2 clear then again magnification does not depends on the distances and all so that m is equals to what i can write clearly m1 into m2 why because they are placed just next to other so that is what whenever you get the we are cutting the lens at that time this will be the methodology and then whenever we are arranging the lens very close to each other another is whenever apart from each other clear that is about the formulas you just copy everything everything you copy cutting other lens everything Why Sangeetam you are crying? No. You are crying because of Akshita is sitting next to you. What is that Akshita? Our Nidha Nidha Bartha is here. Nidha Bartha is here.
How was your exam? I forgot to ask. And Jai, Jai Chiranjeeva. What about the atoms and nuclei? Jai, double Jai, yeah. Jai Jai, Jai Hind directly. One fifty above. Hey, are the atoms and nuclei? Are they not that do? Castle chapter is not. One fifty above. What about? Who is that? Hundred above. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? Eighty, na? Ninety. First time, ah, to cut my marks, ah? Bunny, they already. Who is that? One hundred above. Yeah, it's easy chapter, so you know. What happened? Question paper was difficult, ah? मते आके मारी लानी वेलरो क्लास अली कवर आगे ला मॉडल्स हो नादर निम्नी एग्जाम मुड़ा जाइए ये ना माफी लगे तो ये ना हाथरान जाने ये नहीं बड़ी फेल्ट बैड नीट एग्जाम उड़ा जाए अंदर नले नीट एग्जाम वीकेंड एग्जाम जाए अंदर आस्टे ये नहीं ला सो अरेंजमेंट ऑफ पीसेस ऑफ़ द लेंस ये के लेंस के तुकड़ा तुकड़ा मारी अरेंज मार बेको ये नहीं हो रहा जा व्हाट यू आर थिंकिंग Right. What happens to the focal length? This is F and then this is F dash equals to how much? What happens to the focal length? I said one trick. Same. Same or different? What happening to the width by the way? Same. Don't think about the diagrams and all. Same diagram only just I made two pieces. You don't think that bigger diagram, bigger width, smaller width and all. Okay. Same diagram only. So that here what I can say this width is totally is D nothing but this total also how much? D, D. D only right? Then width is not changing then what happens? Focal length also does not change yes. That is F dash is equals to F. Then whenever you are arranging the same lens pieces like this. One is in this manner. One is in this manner. What happens? F dash equals to how much again? F only. Why? Because again width is same only. Then F dash is equal to F. Now, second case is different in this. Whenever you are cutting the lens along the principal axis, and we know already it will become two pieces, then what happens? Focal length will change, sir? Does not change, sir? Does not change. Now, what I am doing? Nothing but I am just taking the lower half and then I am just arranging in this manner. Like this. Then what happens to the focal length? Decreases or increases? Otherwise, if it decreases nothing but how many times it will decrease? One by two. Why? Because here width is doubled. Width is doubled nothing but focal length will become exactly half. F dash is equal to F by two. Why? Because this is D here. Totally it is becoming as how much here? 2D. As the width increases then focal length will decreases. Then next case is very very important case. Whenever I have taken two lengths in opposite nature like this then what happens tell me then what happens tell me then it will just work like a plain uh, mirror only plain mirror and the plain glass then f dash becomes infinity whenever you are taking in opposite nature see that one is converges another is diverging so nothing happening there so what happens nothing but the focal length will become infinity there Clear? That is, a, that is the arrangement of the pieces of the lenses. <coughs> Copy that. Still silvering of lens is there. Still displacement method is there. 
ಸಾಕಮ್ಮ ಸಾಕಮ್ಮ ಊಟ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ರೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಸಾಕು ಅನ್ನಲ್ಲ ಮಾಮ ಅವ್ರ ಜೊತೆ ಮಾತಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ರೆ ಅಂದರೆ ಸಾಕು ಅನ್ನಲ್ಲ ಇವಾಗ ಸಾಕು ಸಾಕು ಅಂತಾರೆ ಅವ ಅವ್ರು ಯಾವ ಯಾವಾಗ ಸಿಗ್ತಾರ ಅನ್ನು ವೆಯ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇರ್ತಾರೆ ಇವರು ಬರ್ತಾರ ಬರ್ತಾರ ಬಂದಿಲ್ಲ ಏನು ಬಂದಿಲ್ಲ ಅನಿ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಅವರ್ಸ್ಗಳು ಇರೋಕೆ ಆಗ್ತಾ ಇಲ್ಲಪ್ಪ ಬಂದು ದೀಪಿಕಾಗೆ ಏನಂತ ಇದ್ದೀನಿ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಮಾಮ ಅಯ್ಯೋ 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 ಯಾಕೆ ಇವ್ರು ಮಿಸ್ ಆಗ್ತಾರೆ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಾ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಹಿ ಫೆಲ್ಟ್ ದಟ್ ಶಿ ಈಸ್ ಮಿಸ್ಸಿಂಗ್ ಮೀ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಈ ಕೇಮ್ ಟು ದ ಹಾಸ್ಟೆಲ್ ರೈಟ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಬನ್ನಿ ಸಿಲ್ವರಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಲೆನ್ಸಸ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಬೇಸ್ಡ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಬೇಸ್ಡ್ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಸಿಲ್ವರಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಆನ್ ಐಕ್ವಿ ಕಾನ್ವೆಕ್ಸ್ ಲೆನ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ದಟ್ ಒನ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸಿಲ್ವರ್ಡ್ then what happens what process will takes place in this what happens first whenever i just placed an object in front of this then what happens object is placed first what happens rays will incident on the lens right first of all this everything is lens only this one is silvered silver nothing but the other surface will be which surface reflecting surface whenever i have taken a glass for the glass i'm just uh, silvering one side nothing but i'm painting in one side then other side will work like a what a mirror only so here also here the incident ray is falling on the lens like this then what happens after that refraction why because it is going from which medium to which medium here air medium to glass medium then what happens refraction will happen it will bend like this on the mirror it is falling then what pro- what process will take place reflection so that it is coming back again into the same medium reflection then again whenever it is finding this boundary again what happens refraction will happen it will bend away from the normal in this way so now tell me how many refractions are there how many reflections are there two refractions and one reflection while going one refraction hitting coming back reflection again coming out it is refraction so two refractions and then one reflection so equivalent diagram i want to draw is it will not happen in reality but the phenomena based on the phenomena i am just drawing that first is what happening refraction lens process then next one is next process is what refraction after that reflection nothing but what process that is mirror then after that again again what happens it will reflect back and then again which process is going on here refraction so again lens only i'm not saying that whenever i separate it it will become like that i'm just saying that these are the different process which are going on here lens will indicates the refraction process and the mirror will indicates the reflection process here so clearly if i want to write the focal lens here fl fm and then fl again so the net focal length is how much as per the before formula we have done already whenever arranged uh, one next to another then what i, what I can write 1 by f is equals to 1 by fl plus 1 by fm plus 1 by fl so that what i can write here 2 by fl plus 1 by fm now here tell me that the equivalent process is which process finally see that refraction nothing but what the light has to go from one side of the medium to other side of the medium is it going like that it is bouncing back into the same medium nothing but which process is equal in reflection nothing but it will behaves like a mirror this entire combination behaves like a mirror which type of mirror that will be concave mirror or convex mirror that i'll explain you but you just uh, you just uh, remember that it is uh, just based on it is just like a mirror only okay and also here the focal length is 1 2 by fl plus 1 by fm what is this fl value if radius is r refractive index is mu what is the fl value r by 2 into mu minus 1 correct so that is what the focal length will substitute and after that power power p is equals to what i can write here p is equals to 2 pl plus 1 pm correct and also power of the mirror is equals to what is the formula 
minus 1 by f. So that what will get here? Minus pm we will get. Clear? That is a power. This is about uh, one type of silvering. Whenever you consider, if I consider the plano convex lens, plano convex lens, one side is uh, silver like this. Then what will be the final answer? Yeah. F value I want. Yeah. F, F value I want to find. Capital F. Again, how many refractions? Always two refractions and one reflection. So two refractions, nothing but one by F is equals to two by F L plus uh, one by F M. What is the focal length of the plane mirror? Radius of the plane mirror is how much? Infinity. Radius of the plane is infinity. Radius, radius is infinity means focal length also how much? Infinity only. Why? Because F is equals to R by two. So if f is infinity nothing but 1 by infinity becomes how much? 0. Then 1 by f is equals to 2 by fl or f is equals to fl by 2. fl formula is what? For the plano convex lens. What is the formula? r by mu minus 1. That divided by 2. Then it will become as r by 2 into mu minus 1. That is the focal length. Then power. P is equals to what will get? P is equal simply what is the formula? 1 by F. That will be how much? 2 into mu minus 1 by R. In the same manner, you have to find for the different combinations, different silvering surfaces. Clear everything you understood, right? Let's copy that. I will give you some work problems also. <coughs> when we silver, when we for any lens when we silver any lens two refractions and one reflection will take place two refractions and one reflection will take place And the entire combination will behave like a mirror. And